It's us. Yes, it is. Might be. What it do? JT. <laughs> what? What? No. <laughs> yeah, we back. No. What it do? You know. I ain't forgot. It's, it's, I, I did. I damn near 2012 forgot. 2012 is almost over. It's almost over. It's how I began. And I hope it's how you end. <laughs> You're trying to kill me off. Uh, yes. <laughs> I hope it's how it ends. Yes. I hope you die tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you, you got to come up with something else. You know, the people want something else. Got to because well, I, I just, we'll see what 2013 brings. We almost didn't make it. Uh, you that's know, what they you know, said. December 21st came. And yeah, went. You know, I, I said my prayers. I asked God to forgive me for all my sins. Just in case. He was there all night. And then I woke up like, damn, I got to go to work. Mm-hmm. And uh, it was another a regular old day. A regular old day, still living. Ain't nothing happened yet. So you you mean tell me you didn't sell all your stocks? You know I I you know, you I did about, about three of them. You know, but I kept the other ones though. Mm. Now you got to get rid of all of it. Now I, you know I I didn't want to be the fool. Uh, I know. feel like I, I actually didn't hear too many people like too many stories. About people like selling all their possessions and all that. <laughs> like the fifth one this year. Yeah, damn it. You know, every time in the world. Like, I done sold all my shit yeah. in May. <laughs> then they had third tell me October. Yeah. And, you know, nah, it was nah, too much. By the nah, time we had one in August, we had, you know, it was just like every three months, somebody was saying <laughs> the world was, some, some tribe, you know, came up with something. So, you know, hey, we still here, folk. We are still here. And uh, it, it's the end. So you know it's the end of the it, year. Yes, end of the I'm year. I'm like you. You done felt. You done right, said. Man, <laughs> December thirty first. <laughs> I declare. Nah. What was that preacher name? Uh, camping. Harold Camping. Oh, that's his name. Yeah. Oh, the one. Not, that said, he oh. didn't do the, the December twenty first for the Mayans, but he's he, the one that was who was saying in May. Huh? Like he was out in the desert or some shit, like waiting on something. I don't know about that, but he's the one that predicted that like May. He was like, the end of the world is gonna happen in May, and or then he, when he, May came, yeah, it's like, yeah, like he, the, yeah, the people have been else. chosen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so wait till like October. But it was always it seemed like it was the whole the world was the chosen folk. The twenty first was the the consistent part. So oh okay, uh, I was always the twenty first. I, I guess, but twenty first is coming going again. Well, let's wait till January twenty first. I was gonna, you know, what I was gonna do. I was gonna call you. And was like, is your parents still here? Because <laughs> <laughs> if they if they disappeared, <laughs> then we we, we left. <laughs> the rapture has come and gone. Because <laughs> you know they blessed and highly favored. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, are you see me? <laughs> that I'm like, I, in one tear. But I know you'd be left behind. Oh. Uh, that's why I was gonna call you because I nah, knew oh, you'd be here. Um, your parents might be going on, but you would be here. I still be here. Uh, in the rapture. Well, hold the lighter, though. God damn it! <laughs> I done killed your yeah, ass now. You always killing my my my. my you always <laughs> damning my spirit, my countenance. <laughs> God damn! <it. laughs> damn, I'm like a little bird. You <laughs> you <ass. laughs> shooting you down. Yeah, shoot me down. You're too high for me. <laughs> Bring your ass back down to earth. <laughs> uh, I'm just glad we uh, were able to come back, though. You know, yeah. uh, dealing with your ass every now and then. You know, you you like to you like to cancel out. You know, well, folk. I don't know. That's I guess that's why they call me JT. Nope. Uh, I don't like know. what's the correlation? I don't know. All right. I, don't, I, I damn near didn't know what you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> so I just, <laughs> I just came right in. <laughs> That's why they call me JT people. You know. Because they can. Yeah. Just whatever. So so you know what so you know what what's your you have any regrets? From two thousand twelve. Two thousand twelve. You know, you, you know, some things happened. It's in two thousand twelve went fast in my opinion. It did. Well, shit, everything going fast, you know. Man, and, you know, I don't know if it's because I'm getting old. Yes. <laughs> that it? I mean, that, that's one Or it just seems like time is just it's flying. I mean, I'm not that old. Oh, flipping. But maybe it's because I'm not doing nothing. But you feel... It, I would think that if you're not doing anything with your life or with yourself, with, then you it would be going slow. You get bored. You get tired, mm. like, waiting on the next day, you know. 
But it's just everything's going so fast. It is. And I mean, Thanksgiving, Christmas went like. Where did the summer go? Uh, it was hot. I know that. I don't even remember that. I do. It was hot as hell. It, it was. I feel like it really and wasn't it was, that hot this this summer. Nigga, it was a hundred degrees for like two months straight. Where where were you? Not in Kansas City. Why not? Nah, I think you probably you probably talking about last year. Nope. Nope. A hundred degrees. Is it? Two months straight. Yes. Impossible. Hot with two T's. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where you were. I don't think it was two months, man. It probably was like a week, maybe. No, but it wasn't no man. Thing. It was hot. Ask somebody who know. I'm gonna need you to pull up. I don't, I don't know. You, I, you I'll Google, Google it. I'm gonna have to Google that because that don't make sense. Google I wasn't it. here. I wasn't here. I, uh, you was here. No, I, I don't know. I was probably in the rapture. Nah, uh, not. Oh, I got, you got thrown out. <laughs> we made a mistake. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I can't say that I, I have regrets from 2012. It's just, I don't know. You, I know like, you, you roll. I just go with the flow. That's what they used to call me back in the day, you know, to go with the flower. So, oh. you know, you got sometimes you got to just let it ride. Yeah, I didn't, you know, I didn't, like I can't be disappointed in shit that I didn't do well, because I didn't want to do it, basically. Uh, I, I guess, you know, I don't know. feel that way. What about you? Know, you know, I, I don't know. I, I, I might have. Really, I, I, I really haven't. No. What? <laughs> I'm trying to think of stuff. You know, you don't have like, any regrets or what? You know, I, you know, I, I did the things that I, I needed to do, mm -hmm. but you know, it ain't really nothing. Do you regret not regrettable. being able to do what you wanted to do? Yeah. What it, are the it was nothing out there that I, you know that I, you know. So I'm like, it was. It wasn't nothing that I missed out on. Mm -hmm. I'll say it like that, and you know that's I really don't have no. Regrets. So you don't feel like you did? You spent a little too much time this year in the like the bar and shit like that? Cause you you no, no, uh, spent don't, a lot of time. Don't live uh, your life through me. I'm it not, sound, it sound I'm, like you're trying to. I'm trying to have a heart to heart with your ass. Mm -mm, mm -mm. This is your intervention. You thought it was a show. Oh really? <laughs> 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 Doctor Drew, come on out. Stop the tape. <laughs> <laughs> no, but no, I, it was a lot of stuff. I feel like went on this year. We had a lot of killings. Uh, yeah. Uh, was uh was Trayvon Martin on. this year? That was yeah. I think Trayvon January, Martin? February. Yeah. It it, it it seemed like uh like, it seemed like two years. years. Well, it seemed like a long time. It was ago. this year. So yeah. so this it was this year we was wearing the hoodies. It, yes. Mm. It, a lot happened in 2012. It was a it was a lot of crazy. It was extra. It was a lot of extra shit. I would agree. You know what I'm saying? It, it was, you know, it, I wouldn't say abnormal, but it was just a, a lot of it. You know, it was like, well, come Well, on. some of it was abnormal because we weren't used to hearing about it, especially in the numbers that we were hearing. I I, I think that was the only the thing. That, and that's what I'm saying. I think the only thing is the numbers. I don't think as far as what went on, you know, we, we've heard it before. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, innocent black person getting killed. We heard it before. Uh... School shootings, we've heard it before, you know. But it was just, you know, it, but it was seemed like something happening every like every couple of weeks mm -hmm. to where you know it was national news type shit, you know. What about uh, Chicago and shit? Chicago is going to hell all of a sudden. I mean, they they been you know just bad, but you know they just they done, uh, they you know they just they evilness all of a sudden. There was that was a point in my life where I wanted to actually move to Chicago. I but wanna, and you I know, move there right I, now, brother. You don't think I can handle it? You remember I used to be from the streets back back in the day. Just I know. To, don't confuse the button up. Uh, you know, you I confused it. I, that was, that was, <laughs> <laughs> I still got games and tendencies. <laughs> no, it, uh, I, no, I don't know. The but see, I think when I was talking about moving to Chicago, it wasn't for. I thought that there were like. Job opportunities there. I was going to. I was trying to be do something and be What's someone. Life? I didn't really look into or think about the violence that was going on because I didn't really. You didn't hear about it. I think the first time I heard, and you can call me ignorant if you want to. We can. We can. But the first time I heard about like any type of corruption or whatever in Chicago, aside from you know TV shows, because you can't really believe that. But was when uh, was it uh, Blagojevich or whatever. Uh, was he the governor? Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. I, was he the governor? 
or something like that. It was up. Yes, it, like when he, time, yes. like when he was, what was he running for? Governorship. He was already the governor. I don't know. Anyway, uh, he, it was like a scandal surrounding him, and oh, it was when President he was Obama, to sell his, uh, Obama, uh, Obama, yeah, and that's when yes. people were saying like how corrupt the system is in Chicago, how corrupt the police are. But the, the mind so, is there, though. I mean, the who? That's where the mind was from, Chicago. No, I didn't know that. God damn. I didn't watch the, you talk about I didn't watch the movie Chicago with Queen Latifah. I mean I mean that's just news. It's America. That's that's you know that, that's you know the mob was there and you know the Muslims are there. Mm -mm. Are they there? What <sighs> is that a racist statement? Nation of, no, nation <laughs> <laughs> Nation of Islam. They stationed in Chicago. I I didn't know that. Well, you I, feel like I, day, right? well, I learned something today. I feel like you you supposed to be Muslim to know that. No, just uh, somewhat well, intelligent. Uh, right on. You know, I, I don't have. But that, that's I mean that's 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 in my known knowledge. Might be. You got to get out. I ain't getting out. Read nowhere. the paper. Or, or <laughs> my coworker asked me today. He said, "I would ask you what you're gonna do this weekend, but I know you ain't getting out your bubble. <laughs> so, <laughs> so you so gonna why? be at the house drinking." <laughs> I said, don't, you know, I said, you don't know me like that, motherfucker. I used to go face yeah. me in the bubble spot. You knew. You can, yeah. I know you're going to be in your bubble. You ain't coming out. That was rude. You don't talk to people like that, especially at work. That's what, that's what it is at work. And then, I will let me get out the you. door first. I'm still trying to clock out. Mm. That's how people are nowadays. You know, they, they don't have, they ain't concerned about nobody. You know nowadays, you know you don't think so. And shootings and and everything else going on, scandals. But and I think the one thing I will say, I feel like social media has has erupted as like this big, almost like a separate media outlet itself. Not as far. I feel like, like we learn more news from social media and from other people mm -hmm. as opposed to watching TV. You know, you on Twitter, you learn stuff fa or, you know, hear about stuff faster. And, you know, on Facebook, faster than you on your local news station. Yeah. And you got you got so many people talking about it that you get a, a difference of opinion. So a lot of people want to... to the, where they're leaning you toward the, the social media more so. Friends. And then you got even news outlets, reputable news outlets, quoting <laughs> people's you know, statistics, you know, stats <laughs> from Twitter. They, they, and, yeah, and, yeah. And some Joe says <laughs> that uh, he doesn't like President Obama. So there you go, folks. Uh, Sally. And look, they quoting it as a Yeah, guy. yeah. <laughs> she says nothing's happening where she lives. So you know, <laughs> it must be it nice. Must, yeah, <laughs> and this is and this is America, people. This is down home America, and you know they they come with that bullshit, and and, and, and it's the gospel. It, it becomes it's the, the gospel. You know, Twitter's becoming like Wikipedia. Everybody go. You, you used to go to uh, Google to try to find and research stuff. You used to go to the library, actually. <laughs> That's what you used. To I be. can't. I can't re even remember the last time I went to the library. Even when I was in college, I didn't go to the library. That is true. That's a, that's a damn. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't yeah, even remember forward. where the library was when I was in college. Uh, well, you know, I spent some time, but I knew where for, it was. I mean, for what though? Like, what was? Like, if I had to, uh, like, get somewhere quiet. You know, you have roommates and you have other oh, shit. see, I didn't have to deal with that. Oh, um, you know, but uh, or like you have study groups or something. Sometimes you just don't want to, you know, learn, learn. My study group, we were like fat. People that just, uh, push you. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Especially, you know, in, in the college atmosphere. Mm -hmm. So, well, you know, but it, it was only like three times. I, I think I actually did stump. I had a class actually in the library, so. Oh, well, I guess you, you had know, to go. I had to go there, you know. I had to go to the class. Uh, we also had the Olympics this year. We did. Yes, we did. It's, it was it uneventful like, though. You know, you had you had like other well, it's a summer, stuff. It was a summer Olympics, right? Yes. You know, a lot of people. It wasn't really about the sports. You know, it, the the attention that it got. You mm -hmm. know, it was like other stuff that happened, but like sideline stuff. Yeah, sideline stuff. But it wasn't you know actually you know. Uh, I watched basketball, of course. Mm -hmm. You know, but you kind of figured that they were gonna win. Who was they? The basketball team, USA. USA. Okay. Yes. But other than that. Uh, 
uh, track and field, you know, we we I think the women are doing you know good, but the men are you know somewhat. So you know that that takes a little you know. The that fire would, you don't think that was sexist? What? What you just said about the women? I said they do good. They they doing good. I thought you said like. No, I said but the men. Oh, okay. Or I said okay. the women are the, you know on track track and field. Track and field, yes. Okay. I just want to clarify for the for the people. Nigga, they heard me. Uh, you you can't you didn't hear me. <laughs> <laughs> you clear around for yourself. Don't 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 bring them into <laughs> this is what I got to deal I don't with appreciate for. your tone. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I got to deal. But you know, I, I like I liked it. You know, for you know, just for watching say, you know, the Olympics were on. I tried to get into it. But it was it was still yeah. But even then, social media kept the Olympics relevant. Of course. You know. Of course. Uh, what do you think about the fact that our, our, I can't, is it, I will say Americans. And this is a generalization. Mm. It may not be true, but this is how I feel. Okay. When it comes to like big shit happening in America, yes, sir. like uh, the Olympics or uh, a mall shooting, a school shooting, uh, how social media will jump on it but then it it like comes at you so hard and so fast as far as the information and the news and the mm -hmm. your desire to be a part or want to know about it <clears throat> that it dies down so quickly after that because if it's, it's I'm nobody's like, talking uh, about it anymore you you forget out of sight out of mind it's just like you know Trayvon we wore our, we wore our hoodies for you know like a week but then after that what happened and who who marching not, not me. I mean, I guess maybe maybe they'll put their hoodies back on once the trial starts. But who knows uh, when is the that, trial? That's what people <laughs> waiting on. You know, we we. I mean, there's nothing really else to to do right now as far as that case. Mm. You know, uh, is he is he's in jail right still? Who? Uh, Zimmerman. Zimmerman. I don't think so. So he did get out like the second time. Then they like didn't get out. And then they took him back in or something. like that. For what? I don't know. No, we haven't talked about that in a while. Oh, yeah, it's been a minute. Remember, I think the My last time that I recall him being in jail was about him and his wife uh, lying about yeah. the money or whatever. But that's, I mean, he got out after that. Oh, okay, well. From what I recall, I believe so. Let me <laughs> let me get on Twitter and ask. Yeah. <laughs> where you been? You know, they're they telling you where you been. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that, uh, but ain't, you know, ain't nothing really else to do. To do until the, the trial, but I, should, you, I think know. until the trial, at least once a week, we should be wearing our hoodies. Oh, okay. I want to show support, like you know, nine eleven. Never forget, and we we remember, you know, on nine ten and nine eleven. But then after that, we forget. Well, I, I can't even say we forget. Uh, we just don't talk about it. it. It's yeah, not talked about. Ain't really, you know. There's no emphasis put on it. But why should we though? Uh, I, 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 I think I think we should like. I think we should learn from it. Mm -hmm. But I, I don't think it's something to. I'm not saying like dwell, I'm not that saying that don't, you don't to memorialize, you know. But that was, I think you should memorialize people that were memorialized. You know, I, I guess, man. You know, you did what you did, and, mm. and you so we should. So we should. So basically, we should even stop talking about Trayvon Martin. No, so I, I ain't saying. I ain't saying. You know, if you bring it up, bring it up. But I don't think you. Sh it should be like a. You know, you don't feel like a less of a person because you're not. You know, what I'm saying I, I I think you should you know form your own opinion and mm -hmm. and, and learn from it. You know, mm -hmm. you know from the, the so situation you, or I mean, but it, it's for it's for you know different people. If, right. if different people want to act on it mm -hmm. or you know and get like other people involved, that that's okay too. Mm -hmm. But I I don't think you know it, it, you know I don't think you should feel like you should have to be an activist on it. Or always wearing a hoodie. I'm, I'm trying to keep it loud. I'm trying to make you remember. Mm -hmm. You know, we know. Uh, for for the person that feel like they can be Johnny walk around with a gun, you know, trying to but trying to everybody. save everybody. You know, hopefully, they ain't trying to save. They trying to kill. Or trying to trying to trying kill to everybody. Uh, hopefully, they'll learn or something like that. But mm. you know, I don't know. We also, you know, President Obama was reelected this it year. It was. Uh, that was a big thing, very controversial for some. It was. Uh, what else happened? Uh, he did win. Um, 
The other guy lost. Mitt Romney. Romney. Mm hmm. I mean, what else happened in 2012? Not during that. Oh! <laughs> 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 oh yes, he did win. <laughs> uh, the other guy probably lost. I thought uh, some were being there. You know the normals next month. Mm. You know that's. I, I was out. I thought this was no, talking no. about 2012. Um, uh, we you know we we already talked about the shootings really you know mm-hmm. that's going around. Uh, That's the big trend, but then you know that that brings up the issue about gun control, which gun control. you know people are. I keep I, for some reason I keep hearing more and more people say that it was like a conspiracy. Yeah, that all of a sudden, the government because they want to take the guns, they are like convincing these people to kill other people so that we could you know have a stronger argument against gun control. And that just that's that but, just doesn't make any sense. But to then me. you know the, the 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 celebrities hopped on board and, and made commercials already, mm-hmm. and it's like within a week. Mm-hmm. And so you know, it, it, it's it's not really, you know, it is a I, I think you know it is something is pushing that you know all of a sudden it became a hot topic after it, what happened. But it's not you know, all of a sudden because I mean it's like after all of this shit happened because you know we got the Trayvon you got the Dark Knight shooting you had uh, like a, another school shooting you had this school shooting it's just like it, it it becomes too much to where you almost have to say something about it but I, I think it I think it for the people that uh, because we weren't talking that already about control, control nobody all was for other than the people that that was for that cause mm-hmm. and so I, I think now because celebrities weren't tripping up about that shit I know and so it's the you know, kids too, little kids. You know, that, you know, of course, you know they they love the kids, and so I, I think that just, <laughs> of course, they love kids. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, because I, mean, I, I think it's just something else they do, you know, for for a lot of celebrities. They, you know, they okay a commercial. That's what we do. Mm-hmm. You know, when cancer come out, you know, we put out a cancer commercial. We do that. You know, of course, you have some people that that actually care. But you know, it's it's. I think it's you know for other ones, it's just a job. You know, this is what we do. You know, my agent says this is what you need to do. Go ahead and do it. Mm. You know, that's just me. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if I. Okay. Um, I mean, you, you ain't gotta agree. That, no. That's just my thoughts. But what does that? So what does that say towards? But my, I, but what I, 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 I think, think it's a but, conspiracy. That's. What, you know. I mean, I mean, it can be, but I ain't pushing it like that. I mean, I'm just saying I can see that thought mm-hmm. that you know, it's people weren't really tripping about gun control until this happened. You know, all, and the media come in. Who who really came out with the gun control? Who who was it? Media. Well, I mean, but what media? What what media? I mean, like who, not social media. I know it wasn't social media. I mean, but what media? Like was it like Fox? Was oh. was it like I mean, what no, but media either. came out with start talking about gun control like? You know, they they're sitting down talking. Oh, well, the now we, you know, now this is something you know about the gun control issue, and, and all of a sudden, you know, the first time I heard, well, after this this latest shooting, you know, I got a text like, "Did you hear about the the, the shooting at the school in Connecticut?" Mm-hmm. One of my coworkers immediately went to Fox News, mm-hmm. and then you know was trying to because that's you know where they get their news from, mm-hmm. and was basically telling us what happened. And within that article, gun control was brought up like two or three times. Yeah. So that day, that's how I, you know, I heard about it. Yeah. So I don't know. But then after that, everybody was talking about gun control. I mean, it's an it's an issue. It's, it's, a, a, it's, it's, one, it's a, a it's one of many. I, I don't see it as a gun control. You know, all of a sudden a kid just started you know shooting up a school. I mean, it's an issue. You know, it's it's a list of other things that need to be, you know, uh, addressed. I don't think it's just this one thing. Mm-hmm. And uh, of course, it all always comes to you know where it starts from, and that's a whole nother issue. You know, is it gun control? Like we talked about, you know, the last show. What is it really gun control? Are we? Is that the main reason? You know, are we talking about the wrong thing as far as gun control? It shouldn't it be something else. You know, mental health mm-hmm. or whatnot. You know, just different <clears throat> stuff like that. Well, right on. What about, uh, in your opinion, what was the the best movie of 2012 that you were privy seeing? I need to go see Hobbit. Have you seen Hobbit? I would like um, to see Hobbit. I don't know if I can, uh, cause I watched the like the first 
uh, I was about to say 10 twi uh, twin Towers. <laughs> Lord of the Rings. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that. I'm like, <laughs> they didn't have like twin or two towers or something like that. Mm -hmm. Whatever. But I saw the first one, and I think I saw a little bit of the second one, and and that's and that's where it ends with me. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm really not if I. And I, I so don't see it. If I see the third one, I'll, I'll see it. Or I see the rest of the second one, I'll see it. But it, every time I, you know, I see it, you know, like eh, I just, I just go to the next channel. You know, I, I'm, I don't know. I don't know if I can just sit through it and and, and be interested. Okay. I'm, I mean, of course, you know, people like they, you know, I like, you know, Willow. That was like somewhat that type of movie. It but, was, but I feel like for that time period, it was just different. It was different, but I don't know. I just. I couldn't. I wanted to get into it. I, you know, I watched the first one. You know, with vigor. Mm -hmm. You know, but then you was over it after that. I, I was pretty much. You know, you I didn't have to see the the sequels and all. So that, you had to know? see how it actually ended. It was like one long story. Uh maybe if it feels read to me or something. Cuddled oh, up in the bed. No, read yeah. to me, please. Read to I, I me for seventeen <laughs> hours. <laughs> <laughs> you it's been a hard day's work. Mm. You know, uh, I don't know. It, it, I, it just, you know. But tell us. No, the question was, you know, I know I said, have, have you seen the movie? No, I haven't seen it. Are you okay? But uh, I asked, yeah. what do you think the best movie of 2012 was? Uh, I think I only seen like, like a couple of movies, like you know, that came out this year. Mm -hmm. Um, I, I, you got to bring some movies up, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Cause you, you know what I'm saying. What you saw. My car, nigga, <laughs> 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 it ain't starting. <laughs> it ain't starting at all. I'm like, uh. I know I saw some movies. I can tell you a movie that I, nah. <laughs> 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 what was what, the best movie you saw? God damn it! I don't know, uh, but I feel like I've only seen one movie this year, as far as like in the theater. In the theater. Mm -hmm. What about? Well, we'll come back to movies. Uh, what about? Oh, I movie? saw Flight. That, that uh, was a decent movie. Did you see that? With Denzel, you know, and it was a decent movie. Mm. Did you go see Django? I can I can wait. Oh yeah, until, uh, I think yeah, we're yeah, about yeah I, can, I can wait till that that comes. You don't want to go see. You don't want to. Some some things you have to experience in the theater. No, uh, I'm not a real uh, theater person. I, no, you know I. It's only a couple of, like Tarantino films that I like. Mm -hmm. and I, I'm not really a, a a Tarantino fan. You know, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm he's a, you know a good director, but just you know I just you know it ain't my cup of tea. Mm. You know what I'm saying. Some of my coworkers are talking about going to see it. I would I would see it. I don't. I don't think I need to see it in the theater. I, but I, I want to support it. You know, I don't want to go see a bootleg. You know, download it or whatever. Uh, I don't even need to. Did you see the Dark Knight? Huh? Did you see the Dark Knight? I did see that. I, I really. I don't like this version, man. I just. I don't. Wait. Uh. I was about to say Clive Davis. What's his name? Clint. It start with a C. <laughs> you ain't help me out it. All the name, brother. <laughs> <laughs> you got one car to go with this. You just <laughs> and I've been pulling that bitch out the whole day. <laughs> and you realize it's black. Yeah, it's the same right. car. <laughs> <laughs> You're ridiculous. <laughs> but uh, I I just don't I I don't like you know the the Batman re is a return or the new ba I don't know the name of it but uh, I didn't like it. I didn't like the new Joker. Everybody loved it, but I didn't care for it. Well, the dude that died, Heath yeah. Ledger. Yeah, Heath Ledger. Mm -hmm. That was that wasn't that was that was the this, last one, The Dark Knight Rises. Yeah. No, I'm just saying that, that the trilogy or the, okay, the this series. Is Batman. Yeah. Okay, I, I don't I don't like it. You know, I don't I don't care for it. I'm looking at some movies from this from year. From this year. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, the the Steve Harvey movie. Um, the book, his book, how to uh, how to be like a man. Steve Harvey, <laughs> the movie. I don't, I don't know. 
I know who you're talking about, but <laughs> I don't know the movie. And that didn't make sense. How to be like a man. With Kevin Hart. And, think uh, like a man? Yes. That wasn't this year. That was this year. I don't that think was so. like uh, in the summertime, like June. Really? Yeah. I feel like that's a. I don't know if that was true. Man, this movie went funeral. What about Lincoln? Like, you, did you ever see that? Uh, no. Everybody said I need to see it because it's historic and I need to know because he fought so hard to end slavery. Um, okay. The Wreck It Ralph. Re- really? You seem like a Wreck It Ralph type of dude. Wreck It Ralph. Like, Ralph. like, like Wreck-It a Ralph. video game movie. I don't know. I don't recognize none of like, these movies. I know. I haven't seen that one. What, what movies? Uh, yeah, I, I could have heard of some. No. Mm-mm. It might throw out some. I, I might have heard of it. All right. Uh, the Waiting Room. Mm. <laughs> Beware of Mr. Baker. Finding Nemo. Finding it. Brooklyn Castle. Seems like you named me mm. stuff. I know I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, it, it, <laughs> I, I, I told, told you this. that you didn't know him. Uh, Monsters Inc. 3D. Really? Yes. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Oh, you see Chernobyl Diaries? I don't even know why you brought that, that shit up. I saw the uh, last five minutes. Oh, it was predictable. It wasn't worth it. Um, I, I don't know. Uh, Music. I, I, What's I, I the guess. best CD this year? I will come back to movies. <laughs> the best CD. CD or single? Um, I can hear you. You got me thinking. Yes, you well, can. you got me thinking. I'm my thinking. favorite CDs this year so far, it probably the only CD that I've heard was Two Chains. I, I, and then I, I, uh, I the, the best the single, best. the hottest single. Well, not just Two Chains, but that uh, was it. The uh, Cruel Summer, that Kanye Cruel West Summer. project, whatever that is, uh, with higher on it. They had some nice, nice, nice cuts. But I like uh, that Juicy J, that bands. bands. That was the, I think that was the song of the summer. I think that was the song of 2012, really. Uh, bands, bands that make her day. I, I would say, uh, band. I that was a good question, Mike B. Hey, that's what they used to call me back in the day. I, I gotta think on that one. All this damn thinking. Uh, I like T.I.'s new new CD. Oh, ball, I, uh, what's it called? Trouble Man? Yes. It, it's old T.I. You know, the last couple of years, you know, when he been in trouble and shit, mm-hmm. you know, it was a somewhat a, a softer side of T.I. It was, but we know, we, he, he, you know, now that he's off papers and, and uh, I don't think he got a probation officer no more, so he, you know, he, he, he can do whatever now. Oh, uh-huh. You know, so he ain't, to be safe he ain't with got his, that uh, what you call the little uh, bracelet they put on their leg? Uh, uh, a bracelet. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> you know what? Uh, I don't know. That, 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 keep, like that. <laughs> that keeps them in the house. It's like a little tracking device or whatever. House arrest? Sure. Yeah. That, the, whatever it's called. Maybe that's what it's called. House arrest bracelet. Yes. Anklet. But I don't think he, I think he had that for like a little while, but I don't think it was. Cause uh, he was going places. Well, he was going places, but he, he had was, a leash he was supervised. On him. He still yeah. had a little leash on him. But I, I like that. You know, I like that CD. That was that was a nice CD. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a, it's a couple of CDs I haven't I haven't listened to yet that I want to. Um, like uh, the weekend. Have you heard of him? The singer. What's the song? Uh, he the one that that did do the single with with Drake, loving the crew. Oh, you probably know that one. Mm-hmm. You know the name of his. Tell his, me you love me. Uh, Wicked Games. That's the name of the song. He got out right now. I don't know. Uh, that's a nice song. I'm not. Uh, I'm not hood. Oh, he's not hooded. My all. hood days are over. You know. He seemed like a. I don't know. <laughs> uh, Miguel. Uh, I I heard a lot of people say like Miguel CD. CD. Uh, a, you know, it's a nice little CD. Bri- uh, Rihanna had the CD come out here recently. I feel like I feel like Keisha Cole had a CD come out. Uh, what's that? Tamar Braxton had a song come out. Yeah, but uh, that's a uh, Tony Braxton Jr. Does she, she sound like? Does she, she sound like her sister a little bit? Mm. You know, I think when she starts singing out loud, that she sounds a little bit different. Mm-hmm. But when the, you know low, she get that little husky, like Tony Braxton voice. Yeah, because she did have like a deeper register than you would yeah. expect. Yeah, you know. 
But yeah, when, but you know when she well, started really talking about Tony Braxton, but not you know yeah. Uh, of course you got your ratchetness. Uh, two chains. Um, who else? Uh, uh, of course you got you know. I think he was the biggest one that really, you know, that was just rache. The Avengers. That's the last movie I think I went and saw. Was that? That was this year. <laughs> that was earlier this year. Okay, the, okay, the Avengers. The Avengers with uh, Robert Downey Jr. I saw and, a little bit of it. I, That's I, with the Hulk and all that. Yeah, yeah, I, I saw, saw it. it was, I, I saw it twice. In the movie theater, I'm oh, like, I, it was a movie that I saw. That oh, how did we get back on movies? I'm sorry, you, you, but you, you know, because I was I was trying to think of this movie. Oh, but I think that was the only movie I went and saw this year. I feel like that was it. What wasn't it like another like blockbuster movie? Like then Iron Man? Sh- no, that no Mm-mm. Iron Man didn't come out. That was a Batman. It was Batman. Mm-hmm. No, and Superman about to come. So Spider Man came out. I haven't seen that. Uh, Spider Man uh, in Anglo Saxon. It, it was <laughs> Spider Man something. The Amazing. Spider-Man. The Amazing. I knew it had an A within it, you know. Really, Mike? <laughs> you just went. <laughs> I was thinking of like Angelican. That's what I meant. What's that, What's that supposed to mean with that? <laughs> you ain't helping yourself. You ain't helping me or you tonight. <laughs> And it ain't. <laughs> anyway, uh, you were talking about Tamar and how she sounds. Okay, yeah. Uh, oh, what do you think about uh, two shows that, that was out oh. this year? Um, uh, Shoot, what, you know, my favorite was, you know, Love and Hip Hop, the reality TV show, Love and Hip Hop, HBO. Atlanta. Yeah, yeah. That was, I, I think that was everybody's. Little, but that, that was, that was the, I, the, I, the one show. Yeah. That, you know, it, it kept its people. And it was uh, like, that was like a reality show that. Like men and women were kind of watching because a lot of them, you know, are kind of geared towards women. Like you know, basketball wives, Every army wives. wives, real housewives. Uh, you know, wives. so you know, you don't really. I feel like that's not for me. Mm, well. But you know this, and now you know I didn't watch the original Love and Hip Hop because I thought you know it was about you know a woman show too. Love, yeah. And when you see love, you know. But then the ATL version. Yeah, you know, that, I watched was, the first yeah, episode yeah. and it was like you just like. <laughs> what did I just watch? You know, it exactly. was it was and it was entertaining. It was entertaining, but it you know it, it got you like semi perplexed. Mm-hmm. He was like, I, I guess this is new. And you know, it kind of it kind of just drew me into the reality TV circuit. That's what they do, Mike. I had to I had to create my own show. Hey, you know, brother had to branch off. <laughs> <laughs> We're from three stooges to one, I mean, <laughs> one blind mice mouse. <laughs> Pretty much. But uh, what yeah, I mean was uh, there because I used to be into like Jersey Shore and you know I think that real I think world that just ended yeah I think that was uh, real this, world I haven't watched that shit in damn I don't even know if it still comes on I I don't know I don't mm. I don't watch MTV or BET what about uh like a a show that like they have like a script or whatever I feel like Scandal was you know another big show I think I think that started at the beginning of the year right like the second half of the season. Then no, it started at the. So it had a full season. No, it's, so it's, it's, it's like right half. now we're in like the middle of the season. It comes back on in January. The second half of the season. That's no, but you said I thought it started at the beginning of the year. No, I said was it? I was asking you. I said mm-hmm. first. I said was it the second. I said was it beginning. No, and you was trying to make your point. point. <laughs> you weren't listening to nothing I was saying because you were wrong. No, I was asking. I asked both. Okay. I said was it the, the second half or was it the full season? And you was like. Mm. <laughs> no, and no. <laughs> you you want to get your point? But going. I think you know that was a big show for a lot of people. Uh, I don't know. It I don't was. know what about like comedy shows. You know, Ricky Smiley had a, a show start this this year. Yeah, I be bad every now and then. It, it was oh, decent. The uh, Soul Man was that this year with Cedric the yeah. Entertainer. Yeah. It, like yeah. I, I feel like it started out a little, hmm, but then you know it. it, it, yeah, it, it was one of those shows little, you, you know. can watch. You kind of expect more from it because it's Cedric the Entertainer and he's you know, one of the original kings of comedy. But it just it wasn't as funny as you ex- yeah. you know you thought it was going to be. But it was still entertaining. So you kind of watched it. Maybe yeah, if they come back again, you know, it'll be, you know, funnier or better. Right now it's the Prince of Comedy. <laughs> he ain't lost his status on that. He done dropped down. He ain't lost his status on that one. Uh, uh, the, speaking of BET, the one show I did peep out, uh, Don't Sleep. 
you know, uh, with TJ Holmes. Yes, with TJ Holmes. Like the the news. Well, remember they were doing it like when they doing it when they first started every night. I, I think they I think they found they what they needed because they, they first it was every night and I don't think every, every, they, you know people just ain't gonna watch you know that the whole week. Mm-hmm. You know, it's just so much of Black Pride that you can take now. <laughs> <laughs> no. For black folks, I sleep in my kente cloth, so you ain't talking to me. No, we don't. And, and <laughs> white tiger, the exact guy. And, but uh, but it was you know I like you know when he have his panels, it, it, it's something different. You know, it's mm-hmm. you you have a, a different voice, and so you a know different they, perspective. Yeah, and he he keeps it. You know, he, he I think it's from Arkansas, and so you know he, he keeps it, it real. But you know he you he think he's from Arkansas? Arkansas? No, I think he is from Arkansas. That's why. That's why. Yes, CJ Holmes. <laughs> yes. Uh-huh. And so I, you know, I, he he he, he knows us, and you know, just because he's from Arkansas, I would think. I guess I you know. You would think. <laughs> okay, I think. I guess. Uh, yeah. So you think it, it's so better though, better. the fact that they've moved it to just one night a week as opposed to try to one, have you know, one main night. They, they think they moved it to an hour. Mm-hmm. And, was it, how, uh, how it was, was like a half an hour show? I think people were complaining though because it came it came on so late. So late, you know. Yes. And it's not really late, but I guess what they were saying is they felt like instead of having two hours for uh, one hundred six and Park because they came on BET, right? Mm-hmm. Instead of having two hours for one hundred six and Park, they should have like an hour of one hundred six and Park, and then maybe that show comes on right after when everybody's already watching BET because mm-hmm. they're watching. And they're One used to watching it for two hours, so might as well just keep it on and watch whatever he's saying and maybe learn something. But I guess they, you done, uh, they didn't like erased that. your mind mm. for an hour and a half. <laughs> then you, you now that's know, where stars okay. are born. Oh, Brandy had a CD come out this year too, didn't you? I didn't. Uh, I didn't uh, hear. I heard oh, a couple song. of songs. A song, maybe a song. Well, yeah, I think she did come out with a CD mm. uh, or an album nowadays. What else, what else you watching in 2012? I really, you know, ever since my Jack Barron went off, I, I just haven't really haven't had a lust. Oh, 24? Yeah, show 24. For, you know, last three years. You know, they, something that just kept me. Mm-hmm. You know? Aside from Game of Thrones. Okay, I just lied. <laughs> I do like Game of Thrones. I do like Game of Thrones. Okay. <laughs> I, at least yeah, you that little spiel. <laughs> You sure have your whole spirit yeah. prepared. I just, I just shut your shit down. Pardon me, sir. Uh, but yeah, I, Game of Thrones is the shit. I I ain't got into that. Mm-hmm. It gets weird every now and then, but you know it keeps you though. This year, I kind of got into uh, <laughs> uh, The Walking Dead. You know, yes, yes. Consi- consider you know I I go to the bar every Sunday and watch <laughs> it with my my bar folk. But it's just it's entertaining too. You know. Yes. And I guess when you can't watch, because uh, I was watching True Blood too. When mm-hmm. you can't watch True Blood, this is like the next best thing as far if you like zombies yeah. and vampires and stuff. Well, I guess ain't nobody on there. If you like that type of stuff, though, you know. But yeah, it's a pretty good show. I think you was kind of getting into it. As yeah, I, 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 I can get into it. It seems like it has to be on, on for me to watch it. I like, you ain't purposely, gonna just, yeah, you ain't gonna you be know. like me. You know, <laughs> <laughs> mark on the calendar. <laughs> Eight o'clock. Here I come. I see you remember the time. Yeah, I knew that was the bar time. <laughs> I knew Sunday, <laughs> Sunday night, night Mike, we, Mike got, out. we got the pause again. Bar, eight o'clock. <laughs> we headed to the bar. So yeah, you know I got trained. Mm. But hell, you know and that that was a, that was a good show. I, I can believe it. It kept me. I, um, I don't, you know, of course my younger the restless. You know, I, I keep up with that. You know, that's for real men. You know, we have your soaps. But that's the only one I can get into, might be. All right, I'm just gonna let you have it. You know, I don't go searching for soap operas to watch, but you know that one's just you know it caught me. Just happened. Nope, I have no opinion. But uh, I don't know what else uh, entertainment wise. Uh oh, Chris Breezy and uh, Rihanna are back together. Are they officially back together? Uh, you know they have. They, I know they, they doing they doing stuff shit, together. You know, mm-hmm. all hooked up. That that scene what together. You know, just the fact that they did together. So you know, I think if they wasn't just you know going as friends somewhere, no. Mm-hmm. I think if they're gonna be together, that that's what they are. They together. So ain't no no questions back, no about backlash. It. Uh, I don't 
You think you think people? Of course, you got some people that you know he's a monster and and all of that. Mm-hmm. But you know, some people just just made for each other. Maybe she, you know, I don't know. Maybe she liked getting hit. Maybe he liked hitting her. I don't know. Don't get him mad, goddamn it. <laughs> don't throw the keys out the car uh-uh. next time. Maybe she learned. You said, please don't judge me. He got that that song. So there you go. You know, I only speak, you know, truths. Yeah. And, uh, and sometimes they might be inappropriate truths. They ain't inappropriate. It's just the truth. She, maybe she like getting hit, and maybe he like hitting her. <laughs> That's inappropriate. <laughs> You don't know. You, you well, we do know. Supposed to forget. Uh, I mean, you don't have to forget. You got to forgive. You don't have to forget. Mm. That's a creed I live by. So maybe, maybe she forgive. Hopefully, I, I'm just saying. Maybe he's hopefully, you know, man. you know, hopefully, mm-hmm. you know, it ain't a, a sad Hollywood music story. You know, hopefully, you know, he, he's. I don't down think his career and, would 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 stand another. What? Like if he if he get into another altercation like that, as far as domestic abuse with a, a female. I don't him. think his career can handle an attack like that. Because our uh, people are already waiting on him to to mess up. To mess up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Already. And then I mean, you can't. You can't. I don't. You think won't be able to salvage his career after that. If he get. If he wants to hit her once again, you can't. That that means that that's who he is. Mm. And there's no there's no hope. There's no help. Well, damn, man. No, you have to give up. There's always hope. Mm. Yeah, and dope. But no. Don't, don't give him dope. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's, I mean, I just think yeah, that. Give him hope and dope. He would lose a lot of respect in the the entertainment. I mean, they would have to. He and they would have respect, to, period. They would have to publicly come out and say it, too, because they're fans, because mm-hmm. of the, the, like, economy, not even the economy, but the, just the, the way shit is nowadays, that your, your fans demand you to speak up on certain things. Yeah. I mean, and you have to cater to your fans, so. If you want to be in that industry, uh, yeah. so hopefully you know he, he's paid his uh, his dues as far as uh, the judge and shit mm-hmm. and uh, the judicial system, <laughs> the, the karate him. system, <laughs> the jujitsu system, <laughs> the ju- judicial system. You know he paid his debt to society mm-hmm. as far as that, and so hopefully they can go on. You know I I you know right now it, hey it's been three years you know. They uh, they had their time away, you know. So ho- I don't know. Uh, we I, we gonna see. That's the only thing. That's what 2013 is. We gonna see. Uh, you know. Also this year, and this is the last thing really I'm gonna bring up was you know Frank Ocean came out, and that was big news for mm-hmm. 2012 because he was like the the first I guess R and B artist to like actually come out of the closet and you know admit that he. Well, see, I didn't even. It, it wasn't really like a coming out. He, he was just he, he gay. Just, he, he just admit that he fell in love no, with but, that dude. Yeah, I don't. I don't and know if that's what people he just took do. it. As yeah, he was saying out. that he was, you know, gay. But then people were like, they thought that it seemed like more like a publicity stunt. Like I guess he ain't showing his gayness as much as they yeah. expect him to. You know, he ain't, he ain't flaring it up. Yeah. So, but I, and I then where, like where he been? Who Frank? Mm-hmm. Uh. He been around. I think he do like, Frank, like that's your little cousin or something. Man. What's your that's name? <laughs> I, do I have to say his last name? <laughs> Frank Ocean. Yes. You do let the people Frank. know that you don't know this man. His mama call him Frank. I call him Frank. <laughs> All right. Right. So now, that's what I call him. But, but yeah, it's you know, gonna, I'm know, pretty sure he, he do like little little probably uh, gigs and shit. Mm. You know, keeping the music going. He no. still got singing. Oh, I remember he was saying I, I thought he was saying like he's gonna retire from music. I don't know. Maybe it got to him. Mm. He couldn't handle it because he he was lying. Oh, really? That's what they say. I don't know, man. I, you know, it's hard to get trust. It's hard to be in the industry these days. I guess we got to get out the industry, man. Oh, that's what it. Is. <laughs> <laughs> we done blown up too. <laughs> too hard. People always say like, "Blow up, she wait." But was the people or just us? <laughs> uh, Jamie Foxx. Jamie Foxx. Okay, bro. Yeah. Okay. It was Jamie Foxx. But you know, it was all in all, it was a good year because, goddamn it, I'm still here. And so, so when you're still alive, it's still good. 
You know. You got New Year's resolution? Uh, don't die. Oh. And uh, that's about it. You know, keep my head above water. Uh, you know, shit that. is is real, and shit has changed. When your New Year's resolution is, don't die. <laughs> it went from losing weight to, <laughs> to going to the gym. To God damn it, <laughs> fuck gun control. <laughs> I'm trying to control my own gun. And so that's that's where it starts. Don't die. Don't die. I, I and think that's real. I'm I might I'ma try I'ma try to join you on that new oh, year's on that, on that new, yes. I'ma try not to die in two thousand thirteen. But you never know, cause you shit, it's real out here. It, you know, it's real. You gotta go. You that's know, what I know. That's why you, you stay at home. Well, I guess that that that's what they do, in America. You can't you can't let it. You know, just just ball you down. It, it, I, you gotta live. Sometimes life. you gotta let it consume you. No, that's how you stay. You safe. don't want to tell the people. They call me Safety Mike at work. I can believe that <laughs> because you know I stay in my bubble. Unless I'm at the bar, and that's but I go to the bar where it ain't nobody else. The bar is your bar, bubble. <laughs> it's me and my me and the bartender. They're like, well, how, how you gonna be like an antisocial and don't want to talk to people? Would you go to the, the bar? bar. <laughs> I said it's just me and the bartender. So, and we don't talk. <laughs> so I mean, it, it's it, cool. It's and they drink. It's like five people there. I, I'm good. Thank you, Mike, for the, the truth telling tonight. Oh, that's that's, that's what, what they, I bring the people out. You mm -hmm. know, I bring the truth out for them. You know, it's just a, a couple of minutes with me, people, and it's my gift. Well, I'm people, that you have it. Until then, uh, cheers. Feliz Navidad. Yeah, that's gone, Mike. This is New Year's. Cheers. I wasn't done. Oh, oh, my <laughs> bad. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you. <laughs> You were there. Okay. And, and Happy New Year. <laughs> Cheers. Happy New Year. Cheers. Happy Kwanzaa. You both. Ah, I guess that we done. We, we done. <laughs> Bye.